So, does the thumbnail change? Alright, plenty of geotherms once again on this map, it looks like. Not a ridiculous number. Yeah, like four, But enough to I be think. usable. Iron is gonna be awkward, though. Yeah, One there's high more iron. carbon than iron. And you see no, where that no. high iron is with the medium next to it? It's like, it's wow. off in that northwest corner. It's a tough place Next to, to nothing else. Like, you're not gonna want that. But carbon, wow. there's like, I guess carbon's usable. Whoa, interesting Ooh. town, by Susani. That is, yeah, That's, that is a word what, for it. I don't see any <laughs> iron even... Wow. Is he sending those all hard. the way across? He went all the way across the map. Now, with instantaneous oh, founds, claim them. that is way, instant way claim. better to do with instant claims, right? Yeah. Like, you went to still, that fuel cost is going to kill him, even, if he, uh, even though he is expansive. Yeah, he better be alive for teleportation, or at least water engine. Fuel costs oh. will be horrendous, but he is in this nice position where steel is his alone this game. For the time yep. being. That's, now, actually, if I were one of the other true. players and Zuzani let Iron, like, if he got overconfident and he let Iron hit that $5 price, I would probably just buy up a whole bunch of it and then go into yep. steel. Oh, wow. We have free scavengers. Yeah, exactly. Well, that's the response. He's got Iron, but no one's going to care. Man, <laughs> all these guys. It's interesting they all Why founded kind of in that yeah. very similar area. Like, Dermis in particular, you should be that's a very awkward right. found. There was... A better location. I've gone in that other crater in the west. I'm not sure about the exact order that these guys landed in. I wish that yeah. still appeared in the chat log, by the way. But it, I just add, I just added that yesterday. Okay. So good, good. 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 Anyway, I'm not sure what the exact order was, but there was certainly another scavenger location that was usable with this crater down yep. here. It's got some iron next to it even, which could actually be relevant this game, and then plenty of aluminum nearby. It's in ice, it's got a geotherm, you know. Now of note, one there's actually even worse than iron, there's less silicon on this map. Game Slayer has already grabbed. Yeah, he already got the high. high. So I Absolutely. like that move. And then uh, there's what? Like a medium know. and two lows. Yeah. And none although of them have were adjacency. Him, I would put solar panels on that right now. He's gonna spend too much money shipping that Sorry, silicon. For three lows. Uh yeah, yeah, that is going to be really, really expensive for him. If you look, if you mouse over it, you'll see that this, this the fuel, fuel cost is sixty dollars. Sixty dollars. Yeah, he is getting over twice the debt for that. You may not be, be making to in cash. Operations. On the other hand, let's take a look at uh, Zuzani. He's spending over a hundred dollars on fuel. Yep. Definitely losing money on his iron. One hundred and forty dollars um, to get this fuel shipped back. So you should only make a move like that if you're just comfortable with debt, that you know you're going to go deep into debt before you can find your way out of that. But he's going to have to find a way out of it at some point. He can't ship, keep shipping iron like that the rest of the game. Well, he's going to have the potential to superconductor a geotherm this game. That could help him mm -hmm. out quite a bit, depending on how fast he can push to it. That said, though, yeah, Donnie Totoro is actually turbine. already in triple wind turbine. He was just like, you know what? This yep. map is dumb. I, I like it. <laughs> I'm going like to just do something not? weird. Yeah, wind turbines I mean, are cheap work out. You're a scavenger, so go for it. I'm a little worried about the triple wind turbine. It's kind of holding that. <laughs> yeah, that's. It's holding that much. price down. Oh, yeah, yeah, double. Stagnating. Double would have been better. He, yeah, he could have gone triple wind turbine. Yeah. On top of that, if he had gone double, he could have like claimed at least the medium line. silicon potentially, which could have been valuable to do. It's a little bit harder to say what else he could have done because just a single extra tile is kind of awkward and yeah. in addition to all that yeah he could have just gone for geos well right now he's making money actually so i you no, know it's it true he a, is a big ball. it's probably better than any other building he could put there right yeah now. that's fair that's fair well electrolysis reactors frozen almost immediately which is understandable and, and it was Game Slayer who did it, did it yeah. He had fuel he, he, yeah, he's got reactors down too. I mean, he's not going to be happy that Do uh, Dermis is also in fuel, but what are you going to do about it? Now, this is actually really interesting. Solar Flare in 49 seconds, and we've got an auction, so people are going to have plenty of time to respond to that if they want to. And the Solar Flare will hit exactly in the morning. Yeah, that is, that is going to be a fantastically timed Solar Flare if someone chooses to take advantage of it. If you wanted to, you could also make a lot of water. It wouldn't be useful, but <laughs> you could. 
interesting, Zuzani has actually bought up a large amount of food and is just sitting on it. And I'm... I'm not so sure about that one. Well, if you're not going to do anything else with it, but uh, you no, don't need to be producing it. No, the thing is, you're not making it. food, exactly. Like, you've got to be making enough food that it's not actually eating into your cash, right? Right, yep. That's, that's a big problem. Which is why we'll see you do stuff like, I'm HQ level 2, I have one farm. <laughs> yes, exactly. Just to point That's that right. out for people who might not know it, because it's not as uh, it's not as obvious glancing at it. Like one farm, guys, crazy. Why are you sorry? Can you explain that again? Uh, it covers your your debt cost of food, right? Oh, when you're right. when you're sure. at HQ yeah. level two, and so you can actually buy into food very easily on just one farm. Yep. All right. Game Slayer moving into farms, no big surprise there. He's actually going to be our first player to HQ level 4 this game. Which I think the, the freeze onto the electrolysis of Suzani was definitely going to play a big role in that. That said, Game Slayer's not defending himself right now. And he's wide open to an EMP. Well, I'm surprised that one Geotherm lasted this long. Or I guess there's a second one. I mean, which, which uh... Geotherm are we talking about? Uh, the one that uh, Game Slayer is building right now. Oh, uh, well, I mean, there's still... There's still a couple geotherms around the map. I, I, mean, I think oh, that wait, a big wait, part of right, that is the wind turbines, right? Like, for yeah. why the geotherms survived for so long. Like, the wind turbines made power less desirable and made it so somebody didn't want a geotherm, basically. Yep. Which, if he can make this work, which he's so far he's actually being... You know, he's doing fine with it. It's not perfect, but it's not terrible. He's already got food down, which is going to help out. But I would say that Zuzani and Game Slayer, once again, are leaders. I'm very yeah. surprised they're not using EMPs on each other's food. Well, I think Game Slayer, who uh, did hit Zuzani's steel, is a bit more concerned about, oh man, $1 iron. Seriously, somebody buy into that and make steel. Anyway. Oh man, how much is he losing from those iron mines right now? <laughs> don't even want to think about it. You can see he's in ridiculous amounts of debt already. Like yeah. 110, 111,000, considering what he's gotten out of yeah. it, is not a Game great Slayer. place to be. Yeah, Game Slayer needs to give up the ghost on that high silicon. He's had it off for the whole game. Well, I mean, what else is he going to do with it? I, he could build a panel. solar panel, yes. Pirates. I hate those but, I don't know, maybe the solar panel would have been the right call there. Maybe he's just not thinking about it, I'm not sure. Yeah. I think Game Slayer's been. Yeah, Dermis is a power. funny game this game because he actually had a chance. Like somehow, I think he took a couple auctions or something because he should not have any debt. But instead, he somehow got thirty-six thousand dollars in debt. He didn't realize that he was actually in a position where he could have really taken advantage of making being the only person making money off of power. I don't know how it fell apart for him. Maybe he spent. Did he spend all the money on new claims? Mm -hmm. I'm not sure. Oh wait, like I'm Dermis. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm messing you I'm talking about Donnie. I don't know everybody's uh, gotcha. Well, oh, wait. Donnie. Oh shoot. I'm... Ignore what I just said. I was totally looking at the wrong player's dead. All right, I'll let you. Uh... <laughs> let me have to I'll let there. you figure yourself Dur out over there. Yeah. Oh, here's what we were talking about earlier. This EMP on Game Slayer. He is just <laughs> shut down. Yeah. Finally. Yeah. No kidding. That's... Right. <laughs> of course, Zuzani yeah. over here can't make steel. Absolutely yep. can't make steel. Game Slayer's made sure of that. Game Slayer is also circuit overloaded. Zuzani's reactors. He did run into a goon squad on that third one, but still just trying to force Zuzani into deeper and deeper levels of debt, and Zuzani's already down at that C rating, not even HQ level 5 yet. Yeah. So I'd say that's going pretty well for him. Donnie's about to pick up Superconductor. Good. And he's about to make it. He's making 500 bucks off of power. Power has stayed nice and high this game. It's been just kind of riding line out. It's uh, yeah, it's been pretty reaction. moderate this game, I would say. I mean, somewhere between 80 and 100 for a while now. Yep. Which mm, is acceptable to make money off of. I mean, that wind turbine right now with Superconductor pulling in 200 a second. Can't argue yep. with that. Oh, wow. Game Slayer. Well. And you can tell Game Slayer and Zuzani are basically focusing on each other, in each other, which is allowed, I don't know. Donnie is in a position where he can make a difference this game. He could. I don't know if Game Slayer even cares. Yeah, no, like, Game Slayer just doesn't want to fall out 2-0 and probably identified, that's probably Zuzani. Because yeah. you well, do game... see him play expansive quite yeah. a bit. Well, Game Slayer's almost got him. He's one away. Anybody could knock Zuzani out of the away. game. 
at this point, yeah. basically, just by saving up a little money. Donnie Totoro, in particular, can do it now. That EMP saved his life for a while. Well, but he just doesn't have the cash. Well, yeah. he, he's invested in the, the, the patent. There we go. That'll do Game it. Done, he did a great job to manage that that black mark as a, sab as a sab uh, sabotage. Scavenger. <laughs> Scavenger, yeah. Very good. Let I me mean, take a look at how much he's done with that. Yeah, absolutely. Like, him being but scavenger alone like, let him kill Zuzani that fast. Yeah, Although Zuzani, you have to say, maybe if he didn't have all that debt. Yeah, four EMPs. Yeah, the combination of all of those uh, EMPs with the fuel costs, that's that's rough. Yeah, Zuzani got targeted nine times. Six times by Game Slayer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That'll that's do amazing. it. I do that's find very it interesting. Smart. Sonny Totoro went for water engine and is now going into teleportation. Which seems a little, uh... Awkward. Yeah, it's a little strange. It's... I can understand committing to water engine because you don't maybe have the chems on you to push for teleportation, which is twice as expensive, but to then go into teleportation instead of picking up something maybe a bit more beneficial like virtual reality... This game, maybe nanotech for later on once that carbon starts spiking because Game Slayer is throwing down off worlds and such. Yeah. These are just these are options that could have been available. Yeah, I would guess he did water engine because that's all I could afford at the time, but you know, it's probably just a little bit of inexperience showing. I mean water engine will have value later in the game, even if you have teleportation for your off world market. Of the off -world but, market yeah. yeah, but but certainly not right now. Uh, an off world is a bit of a kick me sign on the map without holograms. It's true. And, and free scavengers. There's maybe one player who could pull it off, which is Game Slayer, but I don't think he's going to make the effort. I would much rather see something like a hacker array, maybe a couple engineering labs down. Well, there you go. Yep, yep. there you go, hacker array. That's also very oh, standard no, Game Slayer, though. He likes the hacker array if he doesn't feel comfortable with the off-world market. And we also saw him get bit for the off-world last game. Well, he's the, he has the only glass I see on the map. Is that right? Game Slayer? Is that who we're talking about? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I believe that's right. The thing is, Silicon's so. kind of awkward, and his Silicon got mutinied away. He actually mm -hmm. took an opponent's Silicon instead of taking his back, which is kind of weird, because his was a high, but... Maybe he decided it was worthwhile for the extra time that he would get. Who he knows? is making a move on yeah, Donnie. Yeah, he wants he wants Donnie to know that he sees him. And Dermis, mm -hmm. Dermis is basically out of it, right? Dermis, he hasn't right. ever recovered Dermis from... The fight with Game Slayer on the found effectively. So if Donnie gets knocked out, that's basically the game. Now, of course, is Game Slayer successfully making enough money to make that happen? Becomes the question. Yeah, he just needs two more. I don't think Donnie's going to get there. Well, Donnie just needs two more as well. And Donnie has more cash on hand. My big concern is Donnie's still trying to work this patent office. Patent lab, I guess, is what it is. Yeah, you, sure you people you in your names. Storm <sighs> one up of all these advanced <laughs> buildings. <laughs> I can't handle it. If he cancelled that, he would pretty easily, pro I think, be able to push to the full five. So, but he's still letting it go. And in a game where you're going to die, patents usually are kind of a mistake, I've found. <laughs> yeah. I'm just throwing it out there. Usually patents don't do a whole lot if you're out of the game. Yeah, I, just... I tend to agree. Well, he let it finish. That's a lot of resources down the drain he could have used, I think. He's going to get one more, at least. But now it's a question, rather than a guarantee that he lives. Well, Game Slayer can get one more stock, and then we're just a race for the last one. He's not going to go for it, though, right away. He's going to try and play out this shortage, see if he can get both of them. And this might be enough to push him through before Donnie can get there himself. It's going to be a very uh, it's close, real close It's so close. But I think Donnie's going to get there once you count in the stock cooldown for Game Slayer. Yeah, he's, he's constantly selling. You can see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's he's, he there. knows. He knows. There he goes. He's got it. He did get it. It was close, though. Yeah, that was close. Game Slayer almost has the cash on hand right now. It was like, it was by mere seconds, guys. If he had done it earlier, he might have been able to do it because... Donnie would have uh, yeah. had to have I don't think he ever more. quite had the full cash. Oh, I think is he going to go oh, for Dermis? Oh, now he wants some money back. Yeah. I don't think he's going to go for Dermis. I think this is for an off-world. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. Yep, you're right. Uh, okay. Dynamite got bought by somebody. Game Slayer. 
it looks like. Bought up a dynamite. He's Interestingly enough, he's trying to knock down that patent lab at this point, which... It's a little late for that, and it's a little dangerous when you're throwing up an off-world to be throwing dynamite at your opponent's goon squad. And there's really no excuse for it, in my opinion, because he has access to spies for $2,000 right now. Yep. Oh, wow. Big mistake out of Donnie Totoro, I think. Yeah. Wow. Uh, it's a shame. I mean, there's a lot of things to like about how he's playing the game. He just it looks like he just he just doesn't have experience. You yeah, know? it's just a little rough around the edges, is what it is, is what it feels like. You know what I mean? Whereas, Game Slayer's mm -hmm. gameplay, every single thing he's doing this game, I can see a distinct purpose in it, and exactly what it's doing. Donnie Totoro, on the other hand, the big thing that's going on and has been going on for the past few minutes that I think is costing him huge, is he built these wind turbines, which is fantastic as opposed to geotherms, because you can make transitions when power goes awkward. Game Slayer's got two dead tiles right now yep. in his geotherms. Yep. There's literally nothing he can possibly do about it. Yep. Except yep. stop yep. selling power, which is probably the right call. But Donnie Totoro yep. could transition. He could move into yep. glass. You grab, car you grab carbon strumming. Yeah, I mean, Start he could... Some uh, electronics or... Chemicals? He's even got slant Chemicals. drilling, and he's starting to try and make use of that, which is good. I would love to see him do one yeah. more with it. Yeah, he got the high silicon. Mm -hmm. uh, He's got that high silicon going. He could get the adjacency yeah, though. Six silicon a second. Yeah, Four eight thousand dollar auction for a claim. That's also well. I mean, bribe claim. He's just know. frazzled. Yeah. And he could also just mutiny game slayers. That's true. He could just do that too. I think all those could could be functional things right now. He's got carbon scrubbing, still sitting on this this yeah. patent lab. <laughs> Use those tiles, delete those wind turbines. I am concerned that he hasn't gone for virtual reality with a pleasure dome this game. There are no yeah, pleasure no, domes this game, which I think is actually I made one. <laughs> inexcusable. I was job, yeah. The Game Slayer like, just took a pleasure dome location. Yeah, that should have been done like 15 minutes ago. Yeah. yeah especially for the price of power. Well, Game Slayer at least has been doing effective things with his tiles and money. He actually might not have even had the spare money to put into this with the kill onto Zuzani straight into the attempt on Donnie Totoro. Like, he hasn't ever had that opportunity. But Donnie Totoro, I think, did. This is another situation where he could have canceled something like slant drilling earlier, moved into that very quickly. He would have been okay. Well, even area. just a pleasure dome without virtual reality would have been very good. Mm hmm exactly. Well... I mean, Donnie Totoro is still in it. Game Slayer has a lot of open stock right now. And yeah, that off-world market is vulnerable. Yeah, that mutiny. You got it. Oh, and, and I'm glad to see Donnie Totoro immediately uses it for food. That's great. Yeah. He gets a food shipment off. That's almost two shares of Game Slayer. Yeah, that's a lot of cash in hand. Game Slayer can't afford that. I have no idea. It's completely inexcusable that this is not Goon Squatted. It's actually yeah. just inexcusable. The off-world market? Yeah. It's 14,000. I know right, it's 14,000. It's... That's why I'm using the word inexcusable right now. <laughs> at, least, at least he muted it back. Oh. He did. I'm concerned he doesn't have the a good squad for it. saved up for it. Yeah. Especially since he's a scavenger. I mean, come on. And he's against a scavenger. Look, that's the biggest thing here to me. He's against a scavenger. Oh, man. It's just awful. Mm. Donnie Totoro yeah. sitting on what? $110,000 right now. The black mark mm. is yeah. online. All right, come on. I mean, Geek Slayer got the portioner. He'll be fine. Did Tony Totoro? I think he bought a goon squad. I would call that a serious mistake here. He bought a goon squad to defend his hacker array with. I really hate that. That could have been dynamite. That could have been a mutiny. It could have just been an EMP for all I care. If he's been keeping track of things, he would have known that was almost certainly not defended. Yeah. You know, it's funny, there was this interesting moment. Dermis could actually really impact the game right now if he decided to bot into Game Slayer about two minutes ago. Game Slayer actually has a point right now in chat. The black market is online. <laughs> yeah, no, the solar panel is not a good idea anymore. Holy smoke, that iron price. Yeah. But he's going to be getting a lot of money from, oh, oh dear. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The AI There's no over iron there. Map. There's no iron. No iron being collected. I mean, any of these players can pick up a claim and fix that for 14,000 if they want to, but. Not being There's done. Medium iron just sitting there. And this whole time, Dermis just sitting there, slowly but surely pushed his way up to HQ level 5, staying in the game. 
Oh, I yeah. like it. He's slow, he's slow rolling. I like that. <laughs> this is pretty slow. <laughs> Maybe you'll be winning the next game. Might be a bit too, too slow, I think. Line. But you never know. Now, Game Slayer has picked up 100,000 in dividends right now. Yep. I can't see... I mean, right now, the dividends in the alpha market are what's going to make the difference. I, mean, I wish I could see exactly what he had spent on the stock to acquire that. But oh well. Is he refusing to goon squad the principal? The off road market? I don't. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I don't know what's going on in Game Slayer's head. Why this has happened? He's built an off world market, which is a huge investment in resources. He sold out of stock to make it happen, and then he's like, you know what? You know what? I bet it's not going to get attacked. I bet I don't need to goon squad that. Oh, it got attacked. Well, that's okay. I bet it's not going to get attacked again. <sighs> Yeah. One of these the days. Who would attack an unhologram off of market? I mean, he's only oh, gotten Don one shipment off of that thing so far. Yeah. Donnie, delete your wind turbines. Uh, he did, actually. Well, one, but just yeah. for the goon squad. Yeah, just that's for the a very squad. weird way to delete. Well, it was because of the goon squad, right? Donnie Totoro respects the idea that he's against a different scav another scavenger. <laughs> oh, okay, that's, that's reasonable. Oh man, look at this! We caught a dirty rat oh! The what defended! Now, <laughs> granted, it was a network virus that it defended. Yeah. Did you On just the other throw hand, up the up? yeah, he he just recently got that up. Donnie Totoro identified it got purchased, I believe, and uh, yep. hit that with the network virus, but it immediately got turned around onto his own goon squad, so yep. Yep. that's just fine for Game Slayer. That's. He traded it a goon squad for a goon squad, and at this stage of the game, I would call that definitely worthwhile. Well, now they're pretty much home, home free because oh, EMPs, goon squads, and mutinies are all 50,000, so... Mm -hmm. Well, dynamite's, from, dynamite's still sitting around, which is going to cause... Oh, you're right. I ...cause fun that. times. I, so that's huge. I would actually... Oh, wow. Oh, all right. Well, we Game Slayer decided he wanted another... He wanted his well, stock price higher. Well, let's turn off-world market. Yeah, you no, know, once that off-world market is online, I think that's absolutely the right call. You do need to wait for that off-world. Good use of dynamite there. Like, you do need to wait for the off-world, but it's fantastic having two off-worlds work for you when that food price is up at eight hundred and you know $87,000 total, I guess. Donnie Totoro even just going to call the GG. He kind of realizes that... He is too far behind. He's behind in cash. He's behind in stock. He's behind in stock yeah. price. I think that's fair, yeah. but still very well fought by him. Yeah, it did game, and I appreciate that he took the GG at this point. Um, you can see where it was going. He, yeah, yeah. You know, I always appreciate when players respect each other enough to do that. Yeah, I, mean, he, I hope he sticks with Offworld because he has the he has the potential to be a good player. You can see he has some some. Uh, oh no, definitely. Yeah, you know, he, he did pretty well. But clearly, just doesn't have the experience of Game Slayer. Yeah. I hate the AI. <laughs> it still has solar panels up, with iron costing one hundred and thirty-four dollars a piece because it's so terrified of fuel. <laughs> Soren, do you know exactly why it does that? The solar panels. Yeah. It was probably because of the fuel costs. I mean, especially when it's a subsidiary, it's going to. Well, it's going to assume that debt choices. is actual cash, I assume, because... Yeah. I mean, the, the AI, when it's controlling a subsidiary, it, it, is, it is playing the game a little differently. I mean, it's not really trying to, like, make the most amount of money. It's just trying to make sure it makes money. And it will it will not build those pleasure domes, but beyond that, like, you know, it's trying to be fairly conservative. So I think those solar panels were fine. I think those solar panels um, were garbage. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's the context. I mean, a, for a player, yeah, it's a very bad move, obviously. Um... But for the AI, like, it doesn't know how high, it doesn't know what's going to happen with the price of fuel, right? Better just to put something down there that's going to consistently make money for it. So what you're telling me is if the AI had teleportation, it would have had iron there. Uh, did it have teleportation? No. Uh, no. I'm just, uh, yeah, I think hypothetical. So. I, I, yeah, yeah, it, it takes that into account. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, it'll do, it does the math, and it's, the reason why I deleted those is because it saw that it was losing money. In right. that moment, yes. Yeah. And if you're a subsidiary, like, there's no reason to have debt, right? Because you're not you're not trying to go into debt so you can buy something out. At that point, you're No, there's over. not. And that's fair. But on the other hand, $134 <laughs> iron, I think it would have been okay. <laughs> yeah. 
Interest never got out of control that game for anybody. Like, debt never got all that. Well, I mean, debt got out of control for Zuzani, but he got punished for it immediately. So it never yeah, even. Just, like, Game Slayer just did structures. such a great job at the start. Why did Zuzani found so early over there? Yeah. I feel like Zuzani was just scared of the map, is what happened. And that itself kind of killed him. In combination with Game Slayer focusing him down, of course. Yeah, that's free scavengers, that's a big chance. Yeah, and on a map, that's the thing. Like, you're on a map where you're planning to take the only source of iron. So what do you expect everybody else to go? You know? And then you've built expansive instead of something like scientific, which is more resistant. I'm not saying scientific was a real option. But I am saying taking the risk of that debt in order to get expansive down on a map that's probably going to have three scavengers. Probably not the right yeah. call. Anyway. Game number three. Yeah, I, I did want to see and check Black Market and see that Game Slayer made 20 Black Market purchases that game. Donnie Totoro at 15, though. That's not bad. Donnie Totoro also buying one more Goon Squad than Game Slayer did that game. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. That's all. Alright, I'll go ahead and get the next one hosted.